Patty here. It is July 11th and I am nature journaling. I finished my old journal down the beach the other day and my new one just came in. Strathmore 500 mixed media. And it's very warm. But there's a little bit of breeze. Hopefully keep the bugs away for a few minutes. And I'm out here in the garden and I'm going to look at some seeds. Today was about a little work and a little play. I kept glancing over while sitting in the garden because the columbine seeds had caught my eye. I picked a few to sketch and then I worked on moving some of the seeds to another part of the yard. A lot of seeds fell down into the bucket.
After completing my work, I decided to go on a little walk. Let's take a little walk. We haven't done that in a while. I call this the Great Green Lull. The middle of the summer. A lot of things that bloomed earlier in the year they're now making seeds, and the late summer, fall things are working, making buds. Ah, oh, very sunny out here in the clearing. Okay, what's this blooming? It's a morning glory type flower. It's kind of pretty. It's white. Oh, it's one of these vine weeds. Growing on everything. Some of these ferns look like they can use a little rain. Oh look, we finally got blue blueberries. Looks like most of the blueberries have been eaten or fallen to the ground. Here's one. Should we taste it? Got that wild blueberry flavor to it. Oh, look at the blue blueberries on this bush. Wow. Looking good. I call July midsummer or the great green lull. Summer hereabouts is considered to be June, July, and August, but sometimes June and August are both transitional months. So July is in the middle. And as you look around, everything is green, 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 but there doesn't seem to be too much else going on. But look closer. You can see that the spring flowers have made seeds and some have made fruits and berries. Some midsummer flowers are blooming, like this morning glory-like flower on the hedge bindweed. I also saw some smartweed and some yellow wood sorrel. Besides seeds and blooms, there's also buds. There's buds on the summer sweet bushes. The summer sweet has buds. It'll bloom later in the summer. And I found a bone set plant with buds on it also. This bone set plant has buds. Let's see if we get flowers. The deer doesn't eat it first. A few green fruits had fallen from the shagbark hickory tree. Ah, looks like a little green hickory. From where? From up there. It's a special time of the year. 
If you look closely, you can find seeds and fruits and blossoms. What can you find in your area? Happy Midsummer Nature Journaling. Thanks for coming along. Bye-bye. <music>